Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Tonight I have with me the brand new Peugeot 2008 and I will take you on a ride with me, a test drive in the night time and we will see together what is the ambience light inside the car and also what is the ambience when we drive a Peugeot, a brand new Peugeot 2008 in the night time. And this is the GT version it's a great great car i have it today for whole day and i was super impressed with the car and i'm super happy with it this is a start engine button right here press the brake and once you start the engine you will see that all the other lights are stopped and we have this ambient light inside the cabin that you can change the colors of course and you can see the ambience here i like very much the screen the screen is very visible and it's tilted to the driver so you have a very good visibility and also the cockpit the digital cockpit it's quite clear we have the three dimensional 3d cockpit that looks gorgeous let's go in reverse it comes with this new sheath by wire transmission uh, that looks really nice and let's turn around here even the camera I was surprised to see that the resolution of the cameras are very good and also even in the night time even if here is super dark you still can see in the dark time pretty well there now this is the low bin you can see outside the low bin are pretty clear and you have a visible view even on the side a little bit this is the high bin and this is the low bin but we will test it also as we go and as we drive but overall the light it's super super visible now my let's go out from here let's go on the left side or actually let me go on the right side here because it's a little bit more darker so we can see in the dark uh, how the low bin look like so you can see the low bin super visible super white this is the high bin this is low bin high bin low bin it's quite quite clear light and i like it even if you go a little bit forward there you can see there it's completely dark so you can make an idea on how it looks in the dark areas and on the dark streets so you can see right now the low bin this is the high bin oh my god the high bin it's crazy visible look at this low bin high bin low bin and high bin really cool really really cool now the turning circle it's also crazy good on this car so you can see in the night time really really clear uh, everything around I should say it's a very nice pleasant ambient light inside the cabin here I did today a few test drive with the car if you want to see the consumption test if you want to see the proper test drive when we talk about suspension driving feeling and all other information about the car check out because tonight we just chill and drive in the night time enjoying the the city and the dark uh, and the ambient inside the cabin and in other videos i just show you almost everything there you find all the information about the car nice you can see right now it's quite good light comes also with a lot of safety features and a lot of crazy features and uh, like star stop system and all that stuff the great part is that we can change also those lights colors here I like the fact that the brightness of the of the light behind every button it's very dimmed you know it's very uh, low and I like that because it doesn't bother you at all when it comes to brightness it looks really good
I like also how they position it, the screens, uh, the multimedia screen, it's perfectly positioned, tilted to the driver, so from the driver point of view you have a very good visibility. And this is very nice, so you can see perfectly clear there, it's exactly on your peripheral view, so you have a gorgeous visibility there. Even on the cockpit, the 3D cockpit look great. If you put the steering wheel a little bit lower, um, you can see right now, uh, I think now the camera can see perfectly on the cockpit. And usually, to be honest, I like to drive this Peugeot and in general the Peugeot cars, I like to drive them with the steering wheel all the way low because, I don't know, it feels nice. The hands stay a little bit lower and it feels like it's more of a natural position, you know, to stay with your hands a little bit lower than we stand a little bit higher and I like it and it feels like a cart driving, it feels soft, it feels light to drive. I like that very much. Also we can set for example destination here just for fun so we can see how it looks. You can choose from the map for example and you can see how fast is this new multimedia system it's much more rapid and faster than the previous versions so you can just press navigate and then the car will just directly navigate to that so it's that fast and I like it also we can set the cruise control from behind the steering wheel just like that you can set it and the car will actually drive for you will accelerate, will brake, will keep between the lanes and even activate the auto hold function even though I can find the auto hold function in the car the autopilot can activate it and yeah, it's quite cool the seats are also comfortable I have a good position I'm, I'm really happy with those seats I feel like I can drive uh, for longer distance without any problem on those seats. Climatic system, we have physical button here, you can activate the climatic system, very sim simple by touch of a button. That's also nice. quite traffic today around this time I didn't expect at this time to be so traffic here uh, but it is I guess many people come in this area but you can see the lights of the car how it's reflecting in the back of the car in the front in the back of the car in front it looks really nice and clear and it's a it's a nice white color it's a bright, bright, uh, like day, and this is super helpful in the night time. So the, the low bin and the high bin are really, really nice, clear. I don't know if you saw the video with uh, lightning in the night time with this Peugeot 2008, the new one. It, the front of the car looks so good, so aggressive so attractive i really really love it i love the front of the car it looks it stand out a lot and it looks gorgeous Nice, let, let me show you, if you go to home here, if you go in the settings Where is the, in the application, in the settings and then once you go to settings uh, let me, Once you go to settings, you go to here to note screen color, interior color, you can change this color This is kind of my favorite color, 
this bluish ocean blue and then you have a lot of colors to change from violet and you have red if you want dopo 100 de metri trecet prin sensul giratoriu yeah. la a doua ieșire this is the navigation system in other language so i can close it just like that now it's good and you can see we can make it red inside right now and you have this red color so you can change those colors depend how you want it there's no more traffic that's great <laughs> the fact that the car have a taller driving position you can adjust the seats the way you want it you can put it all the way up so you have a tall driving position so the visibility around it's very very good The transmission it's great it comes with 1.2 liter the version that we have here is a GT version it comes with 1.2 liter petrol engine three cylinders in line combined with an eight-speed automatic transmission E88 it's good transmission very good transmission Stellantis group and Peugeot use it uh, on most of the all the cars I think and it's it's super super good One hundred thirty horsepower have this version that we have here. It's just perfect for everything. I mean, one hundred thirty horsepower. It's more than enough for daily driving and stuff like that. It's super enough. Yeah, the lights are, are great, man. The lights are really good. And they look also nice from the exterior. As for suspensions, they are they are good also. I should say from one to ten, I will give it a seven. I 
I take those darker roads in order to see a little bit better to make an image, an idea on how it looks we can drive also if you want with these lights on here so you can see the dashboard a little bit better and the steering wheel because it's not so powerful, I mean in other cars when you turn on the lights inside you can't drive because you can't see too much outside but in this one it's fine, I mean you turn on the lights even if you turn the lights on up there you still have, you're still able to see clearly outside and inside in the same time so this is cool Off. Yeah, that, that was nice, it's nice, it's pleasant being here, even in the night time, it's a nice driving feeling. But for more details guys, just check out the other videos, the test drive, the proper test drive, the consumption video, there I give you a lot of information about the car. This one was just for chilling out and just showing a little bit the way it looks in the night time. I, I think I have to go on the first lane now because we will do right and then we will end up this video. the car here and that's all that was the trip for tonight yeah right here in the place just like that going in reverse and we just parked the car here I like the fact that you have the front camera, it's so useful at least in the night time when you don't have such a good visibility in the front there, it's just gorgeous. I think I have to put it a little bit closer uh, to Kona, just like that, I think it's perfect now, I think now it's just perfect. Okay, perfect, 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 perfect. Parking, electronic handbrake, climatic system off. And that was all guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. And I guess I see you in the next one. Bye guys.